That looks really good. <laughs> that was cute. Sailor Guardians. My name is Sailor Snubs. Welcome to my YouTube channel all about Sailor Moon. Today I have another Proplica review for you and this one is actually the Chibi Moon Compact. So this is the first compact for Sailor Chibi Moon that I have been able to collect and I am so excited to open it with you today. Now this did come out a little while back. I am slowly making my way through a giant pile of packages but you can still find this online for relatively decent prices. I'll put additional links down below for some of the places that you can find this still and I will also put the price down below for how much I paid when I pre-ordered it. Just like every other Proplica that I currently have up here, this does run on LR44 batteries. Three of them are included for demo purposes and you generally can find these internationally as well as being able to order them from Japan. The only big differences that you'll notice if you order one from Japan as opposed to purchasing a Proplica from an international market or reseller is the fact that there will be no sticker on the back that warns you about small parts, which comes on the international version, and the directions which will be contained in the international version usually do include English. So since this is the Japanese version, that means I will have to figure out the directions by Google Translate. Wish me luck. As with every Proplica, this does come in a really beautiful box. So on the front, we have some promo art of the Proplica. It says Chibi Moon Compact. We also have the Tamashi Nations sticker up near the 25th anniversary logo. It also says Tamashi Nations and Bandai down at the bottom. On the front of the box, we have a little bit of information written out about the Proplica, and this is written in English. Both of the sides include some really pretty foil print. The back is in fully Japanese, and we also have a toy sticker. So let's go ahead and open this and check out the new Chibi Moon Compact. As usual, I do prefer to open my boxes with a knife, which gives me a little bit more to work with whenever I'm opening the box, which hopefully will keep it from tearing. As you can see, there is a little bit of a tear up at the top of my box, but I always take everything out, so that doesn't bother me too much. All right, so we have the directions, of course. A little bit of a protective cover on here. Let's go ahead and take that out of the packaging. And it also includes a little plastic stand. The stand is so cute. We have Pegasus on one side, and we also have Chibi Moon's Crystal Carillon on the other side. I believe that's how you say it. Okay, so I'm gonna set this stand aside and let's go ahead and check out the Proplica. So I always check my Proplicas over for any flaws. Sometimes they do have flaws like scratches on the Proplica itself. So I always make sure to check when I take it out of the packaging first thing. Mine looks pretty good. There is a very small scuff on the side, but nothing too bad. Here you can see how absolutely beautiful this Proplica is. Look at that huge, super, super shiny gemstone on the front. Absolutely love it. It's also super hot pink around the edges and very shiny, so you get this mirrored effect. On the back, we have more of a pearlescent lighter pink color, and it looks really pretty. There are a couple of buttons on here. The first one is up here at the top, that crescent moon. There's also a mode button right here on the back. This is where your sound will come from. Ooh, this is pretty. Wow. Oh, there's a scratch right there, I see it. There's a little bit of plastic covering the mirror to keep it protected. So this is the inside of Chibi Moon's compact. Here we have another button, the little star. This ribbon is a beautiful gradient rainbow. It looks very pretty. And in the center, we have this beautiful hot pink stone and it looks so, so pretty. Of course, it's plastic. It's not actually a stone. Okay, so I'm gonna check out the directions and see how this one works. Oh, good. I always look in here to see if we have English directions, which we do on the very last page. Super happy to see that. Thank you, Tamashi Nations. So on the front, it says Proplica Chibi Moon Compact. It looks just just like it does on the outside of the box. We have a description of the Chibi Moon Compact. This gives some additional details about the compact. And then we have the back side, which explains how to use it. So the first thing we see here is how to use the stand. Oh, that's so smart. Okay, so when you open it fully, the stand fits directly into the crown. So this Proplica is going to be completely balanced because it's nice and secure on top of this plastic stand. Cool. 
I really wish the older Proplicas also came with stands because a lot of them did not. So you ended up having to buy like cute little dish stands to make sure that they could be displayed appropriately. Okay, so how do we open this? Ah, it looks like it pops off of the back. So the lid just pops directly off of the back very, very easily. Why are there screws here? That's weird. There is an A mode and a B mode, which you can choose with the A and B switcher right here. I believe this is the mode button. And this is where you put your batteries, LR44 batteries, and it requires three of them. I need to go grab some batteries and put new ones in here. Should you use a knife to screw in your screws? Probably not, but I am. So now that we have the batteries in here, we can start playing with the Chibi Moon Compact Proplica. All right, so power switch off, B mode, A mode. On the front of this, the crescent moon right here is called the transformation button, and this allows you to get into the transformation mode. There are three different options within the transformation mode, which include transformation voice, introduction voice, and power up scene. I believe A is low volume, and B is high volume. So I'll leave it on high volume so we can hear it. Click that back into place since we can access the mode button on the back with it on. So we have this transformation button here and on the back, this is the music button. So the music button allows you to get into the transformation music, introduction music and ending song. And there's also the Pegasus appearance music. Press the button again to stop playing. With the transformation mode, if you wanna use this without Chibi Moon's voice, press and hold the transformation button to switch to transformation mode without Chibi Moon's voice. And then on the inside, this is called the star button. So the star button allows you to have Chibi Use's monologue mode, monologue one, two, and three, Press and hold the star button to switch to Pegasus conversation mode, which has three different modes. There's meet Pegasus, real dream, and your name. You can also press and hold the star button again to switch to the Pegasus conversation mode without Chibiusa's voice. Okay, so let's get started with messing around with this thing. So I'm gonna try the transformation mode first and see if I can figure out which one is which. It looks really good. <laughs> that was cute. Okay, so that was transformation voice. Oh. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> so that was introduction voice and then there's power up scene. Okay, so that was the power up scene. <laughs> and then you can hold, press and hold, to do the transformation mode without Chibi Moon's voice. So let's try that. Okay, I think that changed it. So this should be transformation mode without her voice. I think it works. <laughs> Oh, maybe it's, <laughs> I don't hear anything because it's introduction voice. That's all she does is she talks. Okay, this one must be power up scene. Are you done? It's just flashing. <laughs> I guess that's great if you wanna like act out the scene and you don't wanna hear her in the background. It's like just flashing at me. Oh, we're back to tr transformation voice. 
Okay, so that's good times. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the music button, which is on the back. So first we have the transformation music. Yay! That was fun! Introduction music. Cool, that was fun. Yeah, I think it loops. Ending song! Cute! It's hard to hear, it's very quiet. I don't want to get a copyright takedown, so I'm going to go ahead and end it there. <laughs> and then we have the Pegasus appearance music. Ooh, it's so pretty. I always love this music. So that was the music button. And then we have the star button. Let's go ahead and open it and check out the star button. So first we have Chibi Usa's monologue mode, monologue one. Mode two. And monologue three. Then we have the Pegasus conversation mode. Press and hold the star button to switch to the conversation mode. Real dream. Adios. Monologue three. I mean, Pegasus three. Is that it? Okay. Uh, and then you can hold it again to switch to the Pegasus conversation mode without Chibiusa's voice. Okay, so this would be Pegasus mode one without Chibiusa's voice. So we should hear Helios or the horse or the Pegasus. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay. We're back to Chibiusa's monologue mode now. And I'll go ahead and turn it off from there. So that's about everything that you can do with the Chibi Moon Compact. I think it's super cute. I love the fact that it comes with a stand. And I think that the paint job in here is really beautiful, even if mine has a little bit of a scuff on it. Just saying. Which compacts are you collecting? I'm curious if you decided to purchase one of these yourself or if you went ahead and skipped it because it's Chibiusa's and not Sailor Moon's. I am wondering if anybody else out there purchased one of these as well. I do have some other Proplicas that I will be reviewing on the channel, so definitely subscribe if you are interested in checking those out too. And until next time, my name is Sailor Snubs. Thank you so much for watching. Jane.